The Edge. China's WZ-8 high-speed reconnaissance drone. Why can't that radar see China's black tech? Why can't a $3 billion 6th gen fighter keep up with a drone? Hello everyone, today I'm dropping a bombshell that's even stunned the Pentagon. In 2024, as the US was making a big show of deploying the THAAD anti-missile system in the Asia-Pacific, they absolutely couldn't have imagined that China's WZ-8 drone was already playing stealth flight at 50,000 meters, leaving THAAD's radar screen completely blank. This isn't science fiction, it's a genuine breakthrough from China's military industry. I the game changer, when THAAD radar meets China's black tech. The THAAD system, a crucial part of America's global missile defense, has always been advertised as capable of intercepting medium to long-range ballistic missiles up to 3,000 kilometers away. Yet, its actual interception altitude is only 150 kilometers. This figure, in the context of modern aerospace combat, is like dancing in shackles. In contrast, China's independently developed HQ-19 anti-missile system directly breaks through 600 kilometers in interception altitude, effectively building an impenetrable great wall of steel at the edge of the atmosphere. The difference in interception effectiveness compared to THAAD is clear at a glance. Even more noteworthy is the WZ-8 unmanned reconnaissance aircraft, which boasts two killer features, first, it can ascend to the near-space altitude of 50,000 meters, a height beyond the range of conventional anti-aircraft missiles, offering an almost God's eye view. Second, its cruising speed reaches an astonishing Mach 6, which translates to over 2,000 meters per second, allowing it to traverse 120 kilometers of airspace in just one minute. The US military's proud standard 3 missile has a maximum altitude of less than 300 kilometers and a top speed of only Mach 5. Faced with the WZ-8's high-speed, high-altitude penetration advantage, it can only fall into the awkward situation of seeing it but not being able to hit it. In the US military industrial complex's sixth-generation fighter jet program, which cost $20 billion and took nearly a decade to develop, cutting-edge fighters with a unit cost soaring to $300 million exposed a fatal flaw in simulated combat, their boasted maneuverability was rendered useless against China's WZ-8 high-speed reconnaissance drone. While the sixth-generation fighter jets were pushing to their limits, the WZ-8, powered by the YF-50 liquid engine, which shares its lineage with the Long March rocket, was already tearing through the sky at hypersonic speeds exceeding Mach 6. The speed difference between the two is like a modern sports car chasing a launch vehicle, they're simply not in the same technological dimension. Comparing it horizontally across the global reconnaissance field, the US State Route 71 Blackbird reconnaissance aircraft, once a marvel to the world with its Mach 3 flight speed, pales in comparison to the WZ-8. The Blackbird, an aviation miracle born during the Cold War, is now merely a footnote in technological iteration. The WZ-8 has not only doubled that speed but has also established a dimension-reducing strike capability against traditional air defense systems through advanced stealth coatings and intelligent evasion systems. This technological leap not only rewrites modern reconnaissance rules but also signifies China's transformation from a pursuer to a leader in the aerospace strategy domain. 2. Unsolvable performance, a leap from double 3 to double 4. The WZ-8's double 4 metrics, Mach 4 speed and 40,000 meter altitude, completely overturn the traditional interception logic of air defense systems. In the field of aerodynamics, this altitude is at the lower edge of near space, where atmospheric density is only 1% of that at sea level. Traditional aircraft struggle to fly stably due to a lack of lift, and the effectiveness of air defense missile rudders significantly decreases, causing interception accuracy to drop exponentially. Although the US's most advanced Patriot 3 MSE missile theoretically can reach an altitude of 40,000 meters, its fire control system's reaction time is compressed to a window measured in seconds when facing the WZ-8's penetration speed of over Mach 4. According to standard combat procedures, it takes at least 20 seconds from radar detection to missile launch, but within that time, the WZ-8 would have already flown 13 kilometers, effectively performing a teleportation in front of the interceptor. This is like trying to aim a bow and arrow at a high-speed bullet, by the time the archer draws the string, the target has already moved beyond the visual limit, leaving only a fleeting trail of exhaust in the atmosphere. What's even more incredible is that the WZ-8 can change trajectory multiple times, skipping along the edge of the atmosphere like a stone skimming water. In simulated interceptions, the US military launched dozens of missiles with virtually zero success. It's like playing whack-a-mole, no sooner does it pop up here than it reappears somewhere else, impossible to hit. 
3. Battlefield Transparency, Centimeter Level Reconnaissance Capability The WZ-8 is equipped with a third-generation super-resolution synthetic aperture radar, employing dual-frequency time-division imaging technology. This allows it to not only penetrate rain clouds at 10 km altitude but also use meter wave band characteristics to effectively identify ground targets covered by camouflage netting and vegetation, and even create 3D models of reinforced concrete structures up to 5 meters underground. During the 2023 East China Sea Joint Military Exercises, this drone, flying at Mach 6 in near space, swept over the exercise area. Using rapid beam scanning technology, it successfully detected a high-speed target boat only 20 meters long, 300 kilometers offshore. It then used quantum key distribution technology to establish a secure channel, transmitting 1080p high-definition video and vessel trajectory data at a rate of 10 gigabits per second per second to the Joint Command Center. This process is like equipping the battlefield with a full-domain, X-ray vision, system, where enemy deployments, equipment movements, and other critical intelligence are presented on the command screen in near real-time, providing unprecedented intelligence support for operational decisions. While America's RQ-4 Global Hawk drone can also conduct reconnaissance, its subsonic speed makes its survivability precarious. The WZ-8, however, leverages its high-speed and stealth capabilities to penetrate deep into enemy territory, acquire real-time intelligence, and provide precise target, target designation, for anti-ship ballistic missiles. 4. Electronic Warfare Capability, Blinding Enemy Radars The WZ-8 stealth coating employs multi-layered composite nanomaterials, organically integrating quantum dot arrays with metamaterial absorbing structures. This not only compresses its radar cross-section to less than 0.001 square meters but also incorporates a smart jamming module. This module's built-in phased array jamming antenna can analyze enemy radar frequencies in real-time, actively emitting deceptive signals that closely match real target characteristics with microsecond-level response speed. In a simulated confrontation at a plateau firing range, the WZ-8 successfully created a virtual battlefield scenario including fighter jet formations and missile launcher clusters, causing the simulated enemy air defense system to misidentify targets and continuously launch multi-million dollar medium-to-long-range anti-aircraft missiles, while the real WZ-8 had already completed its reconnaissance mission and quietly returned along its preset course. This virtual real combined electronic warfare capability is like implanting digital magic into enemy radar systems, firmly seizing the initiative on the battlefield. While America's F-35 fighter jet also has electronic warfare capabilities, Facing the WZ-8's active jamming is like a blind man trying to find his way, they simply can't locate it. The WZ-8's electronic warfare capability instantly paralyzes enemy air defense systems, buying valuable time for our combat operations. V. Strategic Overmatch, From Reconnaissance to Integrated Strike The WZ-8 is not just a high-altitude, high-speed reconnaissance aircraft with strategic value, it's a multi-purpose strategic platform integrating reconnaissance, command, and strike capabilities. In modern naval warfare, with its operational altitude of over 30,000 meters and hypersonic flight capability, it can break through enemy air defense networks, acquire real-time precise coordinates of aircraft carrier battle groups, and establish a complete reconnaissance localization strike assessment kill chain for the DF-21D anti-ship ballistic missile, significantly enhancing strike effectiveness against moving maritime targets. In more advanced combat scenarios, the WZ-8 can also be configured with modular payloads to carry small-scale hypersonic weapons, enabling detect and destroy immediate strike capabilities. This integrated reconnaissance and strike capability makes it a sort of Damocles hanging over the battlefield, it can penetrate the fog of war with advanced optoelectronic and radar systems to precisely capture target dynamics, and also transform into a striking blade to conduct standoff precision strikes against high-value targets, greatly rewriting the offensive and defensive balance of modern warfare. America's sixth-generation fighters and Dark Eagle hypersonic missiles appear clumsy next to the WZ-8. The WZ-8's emergence has forced the U.S. to re-evaluate its defense systems, even necessitating the repositioning of its carrier battlegroups to the second island chain. The advent of the WZ-8 signifies China's comprehensive leadership in the hypersonic domain. It has not only rewritten the rules of modern warfare but has also shown the world the true strength of China's military industry. From double three to double four, from reconnaissance to strike, the WZ-8 proves with its capabilities, China can now look the world straight in the eye. If you want to learn more about China's military black tech, 
Subscribe to our channel and witness the rise of Chinese power together. See you next time.